So welcome to another episode of my travel and birthday vlog. We will be celebrating our birthday week at Bohol. A quick short story. I forgot my ID when we left our condo. Nasa grab na kami that time. Buti na lang mabait yung nasakyan namin that time. And a blessing in disguise, delayed yung flight namin for an hour. So hindi kami naiwan ng plane. Lesson learned, if magja-travel kayo, always and always check all your belongings, especially yung mga requirements sa airport like your valid ID, boarding pass, etc. before you leave your home. Finally, we have arrived in our accommodation here in Panglao, the Alona Pawikan Resort. We will be staying here for 4 days and 3 nights. We just ride a tri cover locally known as Tuk Tuk. I will do a quick tour of our resort. We chose this accommodation because based on my research, they are one of the most booked resorts here in Panglao. During our stay, kami lang yung Filipino dun. Mostly na nag stay dun are foreigners and they are friendly and kind. So, here's my tip for you guys. From the airport to the Alona Beach, if you will ride a tricab, dun kayo sumakay outside the airport. It's just a few minutes walk. The drivers in front of the airport will ask you to pay 300 even if you're just 2 packs. While dun sa may pila sa labas ng airport, it will only cost you a hundred fifty. So it's a budget-wise decision. As you can see, puro trees yung paligid ng resort namin. It's giving a province life talaga, which we really like. Ayan, may manok pa dyan. <laughs> Sobrang tahimik, peaceful, and fresh air yung nalalanghap namin dyan. Oh, and by the way, I almost forgot, they also offer free drinking water coffee and tea so if maubos yung drinks nyo you can ask at the reception and they will refill it alright so quick room tour lang tayo pwede kayo tumambay dyan sa labas ayan pagpasok there's a queen size bed nanonood agad siya ng avengers and they have a smart tv pwede kayo manood ng netflix they also have a split type aircon and here's the free drinking water, coffee and tea, and here's the CR. In fairness, malinis naman, and they have a heater sa shower, then may salamin dyan, ayan, opak. <laughs>
hundred step down though. This is the workout for today. Thank you. Tapos po pupunta kayo dito, maglalagay mo na kayo ng sunscreen. Kasi talagang mainit. So we are now here at the top of the chocolate hills. As you can see, nandito yung 360 degrees view of the chocolate hills. And sabi nila it's 1,046 na hills na makikita dyan. So it's pretty amazing. So our next stop for the countryside tour is the Tarshir Conservation Area. Before entering the sanctuary, the staffs will give us a quick summary or orientation on what are the do's and don'ts inside the Tarshir Sanctuary. Since the Tarshirs are nocturnals, the tourists are not allowed to make any noise inside and they are not also allowed to touch the Tarshirs. They are a very sensitive animal and they get stressed easily. So yeah, as you can see, as we visit the area, it started raining. They offer free umbrellas for us to still roam around the conservation area. We got so excited as we saw this first Tarshir, as we expected, they are sleeping at that time. The tour guide told us also that it is their mating season. They are also a very territorial animal. Once they have their own tree as their home or territory, they will fight with another Tarshir if they come near. <laughs> This is one of the most awaited part of the countryside tour to experience the famous Lebok River Cruise. It only costs 850 pesos per box and you will already experience this lunch buffet while cruising the river of Lebok. They serve local Filipino foods and some of their native specialty dishes. We are really hungry at this moment so let's go! <laughs>
Our tour guide told us that it is low tide today. That's why the pickup location is at the Panglao Port. Usually, the pickup location for island hopping is located at the Alona Beach. Virgin Island. We're lucky na nakita namin yung sandbar dahil low tide ngayon. As you can see, ayan no, yung water. Kung visible man siya dyan kasi hindi namin makita ng malinaw sa camera since super maliwanag na araw dito. Ayan no, yung tubig dagat na sasakop na niya yung sand. And mamaya, makocover na niya lahat yung buong sandbar. Pag nag-high tide ulit later pag nasa Balikasag Island na kami. Buti na lang nakita namin yung sandbar. Yan know, kita nyo ba dyan? Nabuta namin bago mag high tide. Yes. Pinuna namin yung Virgin Island before yung Balikasag para mabutan kasi yung water papunta na rin dito. You know? yung... so, nakita namin na unti-unti nang gumagapang yung tubig sa dulo. Tapos makukover na niya yung buong sandbar. So, hindi na ba giging visible yung ano, yung sand. Pero matatapakan naman. Tapos, wala masyado nagsiswimming ngayon dito. Uh, we're blessed na napasyal namin ito ng tahimik. Yes. So, balik ka sa later. Mag-snorkeling kami doon. And sana may makita kaming mga fish, turtles. Tartaruga. <laughs> Date ko kayo ulit later. Bye! We found a starfish! Come on, it's a big one. It's a big one. Low tide. We highly recommend this Jing Snack Snack Corner. Come hungry, go happy. Sobrang sarap ng fish ball nila, homemade lang. Lamik kayo. <laughs> Super affordable pa guys. Punta kayo dito. We're gonna go back to our boat. Let me go. Hi, good afternoon. Punta kami ngayon sa South Palm Resort, and we will have our merienda there and uh, the Victoria lang kami. See ya!
comfortable And no one seems to hold me like you do mm -hmm. You're so wonderful A star could never shine as bright as you mm -hmm. Even the dark they still see light Even the birds still sing at night Every word just comes out right When I'm with you, with you I feel so lucky I met you And I still can't believe that I get to see those signs Hi guys! So we are now here at The Mist and we're having lunch here and this is our last day in Bohol. Hindi ako masyado nakapagsalita sa ibang part ng vlog ko kasi we are busy exploring the town and yung mga island hopping and countryside tour but I will try my best para makapag-upload ng vlog on this on our birthday celebration week here in Bohol. So far yung experience namin is a really great experience. And yung food nila super sarap guys. No doubt. As in, pag pupunta kayo dito sa Bohol, huwag niyong kakalimutan or huwag niyong skip yung The Mist. Kasi it, this is one of the um, famous restaurants here in Panglao. And um, yung food nila is very reasonable naman for its price. And ano pa ba? Yung Ice Baby Bear Latte nila na signature drink nila is super tapang. Yung masasabi ko, indicated naman na dun sa menu na it is kung ano siya, uh, meron siyang free espresso shots. And yeah, so we are lucky da um, hindi rin siya umal umulan kasi yung mga nakarang araw, mga ulan rin eh. So, we are lucky na maganda yung weather today. We'll update you later. Fingers through my hair, no, I get a little scared Cause you know you're my type 